Okay, we're gonna go back to the ship. We're gonna go to Sappho. And we're gonna continue with the main quest. And then hopefully we're gonna get abilities that allow us to um, complete actually the first planet. That would be pretty cool. Finally! Glad you made it back in one piece. Yeah, there me were too. some close calls out there. Please tell me nothing followed you home, kid. I hope not. <laughs> okay. Um, can we talk to him about Need something anything, else? Grease? Oh, yeah, sure. I'm really in the mood for a slow and painful death. You think you could find that sort of thing on this death planet? Or maybe just bring me back something that will haunt me for the rest of my dreadful <laughs> life. Any of that work, you weirdo? <laughs> He's too funny. I love him. Um, okay, let's use the hollow table. And let's go to Sefu. Yeah, now you're thinking, let's get out of here. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so let's see where we're going to go. Um, Bogano, no, we're going to go to Sefu because that's where we're going to supposed to be going for our next mission. So, if the order thing is rebuilt, you think any Jedi will come out of hiding? The order mm, thing. What makes you think there are a Jedi hiding? No, I'm just curious. Is there someone specific you're thinking of? Well, growing up, we heard tales of a green, pointy-eared, legendary Jedi Master, and... Are you talking about Master Yoda? Yes, he is very legendary. Wait, what? Who? No, no, I'm talking about Master Yaddle. The Jedi High Council member? Yeah, we all have our dreams, okay? <laughs> Let me have mine. <laughs> no problem. Okay, can I get into my seat now? So now, kid, it's time to land. Okay, excellent. Heck of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Uh, copy that. I thought the other planet was dangerous. Oh. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Of course it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Perfect landing. <laughs> Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Okay, so we're in charge again? Cal. Our character? Over yes. Over here. You did okay. good work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. Okay. I've heard of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. I only knew that Cordova was obsessed with the Zepho, believing their teachings to be important. I, too, was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn here. Good luck. Well, thank you. Oh, let's talk. You can see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. I like the background. No, it's not. But I think of those who believed in me at one point. If I give up on myself, then I give up on them. I'm sure you have a few of those. Prof. Uh, friend on Brock. Ah, uh, yeah, poor Prof. He sacrificed himself so I could live. He believed in you. A lot of people depend on you, even if they don't know it yet. Keep going, Cal. For Prof. For everyone. All right, anybody who's, like, resubscribing, thank you very much for the resub. Um, for him, thank you very much uh, for the uh, Twitch Prime, and thank you very much for the bits, Fate. Um, there is a safe spot and workbench at the back of the ship. Oh, okay. Let's check that out. What is this? Interact. What hey, Grease, that? what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. 
But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of bar and glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. Yeah, I picked up a seed in Bogano. I think that's the one that I just uh, planted there. Okay, so I have no idea what this is for, but that is pretty awesome. Let's have a look. I never really uh, thought about exploring the ship itself. Oh, we even have a meditation spot in it. That is awesome. And we have a workbench. That's so cool. Um, I don't think we have unlocked any other colors or emitters. We have... Oh, yeah. We have unlocked a couple of things. All right. Um, yeah, really liking that one. Um, switches. Do we have any more switches? Oh, look at that. Oh, that one looks pretty nice. All right, yeah. I'm going to leave that as default. And then sleeves. Oh, yeah. This one is pure grip. Love it. And... Yeah, leaving, leaving the pattern with the gold on it. That's pretty awesome. Let's save the game and then continue. And see, actually, we have a couple of attribute points, so we could spend some points, actually. Um, this is going to be yes and no, Isipion. Um, some of it, it's going gonna, it's gonna to go on YouTube, but it's going to go on the Let's Play channel, and I'm not recording it. So anybody who's watching it right now on YouTube, um, these things get fully streamed from now on, and I'm going to try out a different way of doing it. And um, we're going to cut them up um, through Twitch. I'm going to use Twitch itself to cut them up and export them onto YouTube, and then it saves me a lot of hassle as well, so I can focus more on survival games for YouTube and um, do it this way for the Let's Play channel, I suppose, in a way. Um, which means it gets out of the way, but I get to actually finish a game, which would be awesome. <laughs> so let's see, skill tree. Yes, exactly. So I don't know if I can cut out the things that I'm doing right now, like when I'm talking to you guys too much, but if I can't, then that's fine. You know, it's just the way it is. Oh, very good. Um, thank you. So skill points. Now... Attacking after a quick evade allows Carl to quickly perform a kick attack. I like that. It means evade. You can see it there. That's my bindings. And then straight away attack. That would be sweet, actually. An attack out of a sprint allows Carl to perform a special lightsaber attack. Okay, I think I'm just going to take these two points. Like, I mean, that's just a no-brainer. Oh, yeah, I like that. That's, that's awesome. So we basically give it an interrupt. Oh, yeah, that's pretty amazing. And then, what is this? Can perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. Oh, wow. Okay, so, but that's going to cost us more force because this is a force attack move, I think. So, let's see. Okay, we can't really go anywhere else in the moment. Let's go with lightsaber. Attacking out of a sprint. Yeah, let's do that as well. Oh, man, that is awesome. That is so sweet. Okay. And we might as well get that then. I mean, we don't have anything else open. So. Why cannot. Oh, that requires two skill points. Oh, okay, I see. Um, kind of like Path of Exile 3. Um, I don't know. I, actually, I don't remember. I haven't played Path of Exiles too much. I played it a little bit, so I, uh, my memory would be a little bit loose on that. But um, it's it's an easy enough to understand skill tree, this one. I think the last time I looked at Path of Exile, it was extremely confusing. But it's very big. Okay. Um, I'm going to talk to her again for a second because I like the background he wants a helpful droid. Give you. He does seem to be warming up to you. Cordova must have really liked droids. He decided to leave such important information with BD-1. I only assume he chose BD-1 because he needed some sort of ability to store encrypted information. These exploration droids are good tools for that sort of thing. But I'm sure he's more than that. Okay. Please, I'm trying to collect my thoughts. All right, okay. Because the Wanderer, we could talk until he didn't want to talk anymore either. So, welcome to Sappho. Let's see what we have to do here. Let's see where we have to go. Okay, we have two areas we can continue in. Oh, there's a box over there. I love the boxes in this game because you get like... Um, 
new ways to like new looks, okay. new, new uh, clothes and stuff like that. Cosmetics, basically, so which is there? really awesome. Oh, look at BD1 skin. Nice. Oh yes, it's blue. Oh, finally, I was waiting for something blue. Blue is my favorite color, so that's nice to finally have a blue BD1. Oh, loving that. How does he do that actually with duo? We run. Oh, it's so badass. Okay, derelict hangar. Oh, what did you find? What did you find? What's this? Storage crates. A sturdy storage containers to transport fragile goods. The outside is made of heavy metal that can easily withstand Zephyr's high winds. Okay. There's another crate. Come back here. The question came up earlier, like how how There's respawn managed to not have EA walk all over this game um, with their special ways of doing that. And I don't like this. I kind of like this Pancho, but yeah, okay, let's give him a little bit of color. Let's let's give him a Pancho. It kind of matches BD1 now, which is awesome. Oh, what is behind the curtain number one? Oh, there's nothing there. Okay. Oh, there's somebody there. It's locked down. Can we get up there or something? <coughs> no. Okay, we can't go anywhere here. It's probably gonna be a shortcut for later on when we come back out. Okay, let's go up here. Oh, careful. Watch out, BD. We're gonna look friendly. There we go, very nice. That's that special attack F. Okay, we can scan the bodies as well, which is pretty awesome. Stormtrooper. May attack efficiently in large numbers. The lightsaber will reflect shots back at them. There you go, the classic Cal, stormtrooper. Can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zepho. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. Okay, that makes sense. Which way do I go? I'm gonna go up here, or do I have another way? Um, Sandwich Park, welcome to the stream. I hope you're well. I'm fine, thank you. We can't go through here, so we're probably better off going up here. So this door must be locked as well from the other side, so let's head up here. So it's a nice mix. I mean, I personally enjoy the mix of, of the different functions that the game has. It's a little bit Tomb Raider-esque, it's a little bit Dark Soul-ish, but um, it works. Oh, whoa, whoa, dude. Oh, whoa, whoa, seriously, dude. Sliced in. I love the way he just slices them in half. It has a lot of different features from different games. It's really nice. Okay, we can go either up there or up here. Hmm, I'm a bit more curious what's down there. If we can get across there. Okay. Ooh, did we find a secret? Find. Where are we? There's an echo down there. Mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. Okay, so yeah, it definitely looks like somebody was living in the cave. Several villagers, okay. okay. 
I love exploring in this game. Oh, what do we have there? Crate, nice. Stem crate. Should be here. Oh, Wait, wow. Can you carry more? Thanks, BD1. No way. Did that just increase his uh, capacity for, for heals? It did! Nice! So now we have three. That is awesome. Oh, that is cool. That's totally worth exploring, like, when you find stuff like that. That is so nice. See, this is what it's all about. Rewarding, like, for exploring and not feel like you're getting nowhere. That's nice. Wow, that looks amazing in the background. Well, let's see. Okay, we'll do some wall running here. Can we open this door now? No. Oh, it's shortcut unlocked. Nice. Okay, that's that's sweet. Okay, so we can go straight through now. Very good. Oh. Oh no. Okay, let's do Enemy it. under us. Don't let up. Hit him. Loud and clear. All right, again. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Love it. Okay, we can go up there, I think. Or we can go up here. Oh, what did you find? Okay, I'll look. A warning. This area is off limits. Imperial Code 94364. No selling or trading. Okay, let's go up and see if anybody wants to buy or trade anything. Okay, I'm not gonna go there yet. I want, I want to check out the back here for a second. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Let's have a quick look over here. I think there's something we can go up on. Is it? Yeah. No, no, no! Come on. Nice. What do we get? Oh, all right then. <laughs> I love the way he goes. He does that. New emitter acquired. Duty and resolve. Doesn't seem like there's anything else here. So, yeah, let's go there. Mm, okay. Search Sefo for ancient tombs. So that's our current um, mission. You saw that too, right? I'm just gonna run away from them. They didn't see me, I think. Oh, there's a big. Ooh. Get up here. There's a big guy there. I think we're gonna have to clean house down here. Hey, get out of here! Oh, look out! Has to slip up. Fire! I got him. Smash him. Nice to move back. Ah. Just... There you go. Oh. Need a stem. Okay. That didn't go too bad. Didn't go too well, but didn't go too bad either. Um, where to go? Okay, there's two doors. Let's see if we can find anything hidden here behind. Is that open? Okay, you can scan it. That's like an eviction notice. It's problem, all lies. <laughs> it is an eviction notice. As civilians must immediately report for relocation. Looters will be shot. In accordance with Imperial Code, number selling or trading without proper authorization and explicit consent, this property and its belongings are now under the protection. Under the protection of the Galactic Empire. So you need to leave because land. we can't protect the house if you're in it. Okay, I get it. I get it. 
It's it's for you. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That completely caught me off guard there. So what is he? The Good scout job. trooper. Okay, so we have the stormtrooper and then we have the scout trooper. Okay. Can block limited lightsaber attacks, but defense is easily diminished. Okay. Um, Rathbred, thank you very much for um, the resub with the Prime 22 months. Glad to catch you live. Thank you very much for joining the stream. Drax, how are you? Mother of balls indeed. Yes. Um, thank you very much again for joining. Just give me one second. And um, I forgot something. I'm back in one second. Sorry about that. I forgot to get a refill. So now we're all good to go. The force is weak within this one, yes. I forget that I actually have the force like every now and then and that I can press uh, buttons to actually execute the force. Kal is slow. Oh, oh no, he isn't slow. Actually, that's my description, yes. The skill is called slow, but I think what they're actually saying is like, um, you're slow. That's, that's literally what they're saying. So. Oh, whoa, whoa. The way they get the double shots off, that's like intense. Okay, so is there anything down here? Oh, what is there? Another box, nice. Pays off. So we have two guys over there, and that's where we have to go, I would assume. What do we find? New outfit, okay. Oh, new outfit material. Oh, I like that. Okay, so let me see. If I take the poncho off. Okay. Eh, much of the, much of a muchness, really. So, not really all that amazing. He's down there. Uh, I see. <laughs> I can get him. No, you can't. Okay, let's do it. There we go. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Don't let up. Don't let him get you. No, it's okay. He's already got me. Oh yes! Oh, I love that. Oh. So what is this dude? The scout trooper commander. Able to block parry and use specialized spin techniques. I love that some of them actually can parry as well and can catch you off guard. Oh, please let there be a meditation spot. That would be really appreciated right now. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Where are you taking us? The Empire has forced the villagers from their homes. Yeah. Frightened refugees shipped off to work camps or worse. Yeah, there's more of that eviction notice. Eviction two. Oh, we're missing eviction three. We have to find that. Can I go into any of those now? So we're just gonna have to follow. Okay, so we have to go up there and then go across. So oh, this is, I this here. We need an ability with this. We have a similar thing on Bogan or whatever the first planet was called. We don't have a build, uh, a skill yet, an ability yet to actually get rid of this. It's in the way. It's red, which means we can move it. But we just can't do it right now. We don't. We don't have the ability. So I'm assuming we're gonna have to go across. So how do we get up here? Okay. We have to get up there, which means somehow probably throw over there. Yeah. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, what was that? Hang on. It was noise. What was that noise? Oh, hello there. Where are we? There's a green door. There's a secret. I love it. I love secrets. Oh, yes. Please. Thank you. <laughs> love it. And we have two skill points, which means we can get that other skill now as well. Which is the double force attack. Nice. Oh, man. Sweet. And we're gonna rest as well to replenish everything. Uh, force push, yes, that's right. I think it's the force push push that we need, and I believe we find it on Sephiroth. No artifacts to show for it. Could put in for a transfer. They don't give transfers, you know that. This is the door we couldn't open from the other side earlier. There we go. What did I say? That's the one. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Oh, that's sweet. At least we have a direct shortcut back now. We're gonna get our heinies kicked here. There's gonna be. The troopers are gonna be back. Got a hostile! Move up! Squad mate down. Go loose side of him. I feel like such a badass. Come on. Come on, I'm right here. Crate. It's just really awesome. I mean, the game is not too difficult. I'm playing it, I'm playing it on normal difficulty. What are we so fighting? not easy, but... Oh, nice. Nice. New light, lightsaber sleeve. But uh, not too hard, so it's it's a lot of fun for me, like, you know, at this difficulty level, where it's still a challenge. So, okay, here we go. Here we go. Yes. Bye-bye. I see you. Do you? There we go. Probably should change that to a single lightsaber. Oh, great. What is up there? Is that a meditation point? It is. Yeah, we might as well. I mean, where do we have to go? This is where we have to go, but I want to explore a little bit over there in the back, so let's not use that meditation point just yet. There's no harm in using it once we clear them out here. Oh, there we go, there we go. Scomplink my... Oh, the scomplink! That's another thing we have to do. I hope we can do that here on Sappho as well. Oh, look, this is where the shortcut would open up. Nope, not a special door. Yeah, we need the scomplink repaired. I think there's a workbench we need to find somewhere, and that will allow us to repair uh, BD1's scomplink repair mechanism. 